Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to another episode of Meet the Ship Girl. I'm going to start this off by saying I'm sorry that there hasn't been a lot of content lately. I had a really crazy week this last week, so I'm back now and I'm going to make a couple of videos, but I'm going to be gone and ne again next week for a wedding. So I'm going to make about four or five videos this weekend to tide you guys over for next week. However, this episode is going to be one of my favorite just because it's one of my all-time favorite ships. Today we're going to be talking about Umatsukazi. So, cool thing about a Matsukaze, or kind of weird thing, is when I do this review, I'm going to be doing the review for the entire Kagero class because they are almost all the same to spec. So, to start things off, a Matsukaze means Heavenly Wind. The Kagero class was an enlarged and improved version of the preceding Asashio class. They could hold 240 officers and enlisted men. The ships measured 118.5 meters in length. Uh, they displaced 2,065 metric tons. They had two Campon geared steam turbines, each driving one propeller shaft, using steam provided by three Campon water, boiler two, water tube boilers. So when you get a Matsukaze in the game, and it has the engine upgrade, those Campon water tube boilers are that upgrade. Unfortunately, I think, as f as far as I know, Matsukaze is the only one who gets that actual upgrade. So, the main armaments, they are going to be all the same across the board for the Kagero class. They have six Type 3 127mm guns and three twin gun turrets, uh, four Type 96 25mm anti-aircraft guns, more were added over the course of the war because anti-aircraft defenses became more and more necessary. Uh, and they also had eight 610 millimeter torpedo tubes for the oxygen-fueled Type 93 Long Lance torpedo in two quadruple traversing mounts. So the kind of short part of this video is going to be Amatsukazi's actual service history. It's very, very short and limited. She was in service during the first year of the Pacific War under the command of Tamichi Hara. She participated in the battles of the Java Sea, Eastern Solomons, and Santa Cruz Islands, and the naval battle of Guadalcanal, and that's basically all she was in. For a few years, she was a, sip, a ship in the Navy. She was injured, or well, she was damaged uh, in one of the wars in 1944, and then was repaired and scuttled by the Japanese Navy. So that's the Amatsukaze. I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more, and to leave a comment down in the comment section letting me know which ship to do next time. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next one. Randoms out. Peace.